In today's tutorial, I will show you how to set up dark mode using Shad CN UI. I will be resuming from a previous video where I show you the exact steps to set up a React app with Shad CN UI. To get started, the first thing we need to do is to create a new file inside of the components folder called themeprovider.tsx. I will do that now by switching over to VS Code and inside the components folder, I will create a new file called themeprovider.tsx and I will paste the code from the documentation so it should look exactly like this and just hit save. Going back to the documentation, the second step is to add the theme provider to our root layout. I will go ahead and copy the import statement, then switch back to my code, open up app.tsx, and just make sure to paste the code that I just copied. Then we can go back to the documentation and just copy this entire function and just paste it in here. Then we can go back to the documentation for the last step, which is just to place a mode toggle on our site so that we can switch between light and dark mode. Copy the code, go back to our code editor, and inside the components folder, just create a new file called mode toggle.tsx, then paste in the code that we copied and hit save. One last thing we need to do is to install the drop down menu component that you see here. We can easily do that by going back to the documentation, clicking on drop down menu on the left hand side, click on installation, and just copying this command. Going back to my VS code, I will now just run the command. Once the download is complete, the last thing we need to do is to display the mode toggle component, and we can easily do that by just doing this and hitting save. Then we need to import the mode toggle button. Now we can run npm run dev to start the React app. If we open the app, we can now see a single button that will allow us to toggle between dark and light mode. That is the end of this tutorial. Hopefully you found it helpful. If you did, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe for more content.